see what kind of purses we have tonight. LA. Who makes the LA purse? And there's Danny over there. These fiber optic lamps can do pretty good. So this could be, it could be something special. Is that a cowbell? Oh, maybe, maybe it glows. I'll, I'll dig out my black light. I've been a reseller for nearly 40 years and I can't imagine my life without thrifting. I've learned about a lot of things over the years and I love to share my knowledge and adventures with you. So let's go be profitable and make it fun. We are doing something we have not done in a very long time. And when I say we, I mean we! It's bright out, we can't see much. <laughs> I know, we can't see the camera. The sun's right in our face. Uh, it's, uh, it's evening, but it's still really, really sunny here in Vegas. Uh, yeah, and before anybody comments, yes, he is scruffy. <laughs> scruffy and you know it. <laughs> All right, we are at the swap meet. We haven't been here for a while, so it's going to be super fun to get inside and see what we can find. We had to sit here and scrounge because I just realized I was like, oh, I can just go to the ATM when I get inside, but you have to pay to get in. So we're sitting here like counting change to come up with enough money to get in, but we managed. We so. found enough. <laughs> All right, so we're going to get inside, see what we can find. Let's get shop done. Let's do it. All right, we made it in. Oh, did I ever show my new, I think I showed my new wagon last time we were here. We got the snazzy new wagon. The old one was a little worn out, so there we go. All right, first things first, we got to get some money. All right, well, we're going to take a long scenic route because... The ATM there was broken, and the other ATM is way down there. So we have to go find it. Okay, $200, that's my limit tonight. $200 is it because I am not coming all the way back over to this ATM. So I saw some things that I don't think Danny is gonna look at, like this giant vase it is almost definitely very expensive. It's got like a wooden bottom to it. It is beautiful. It looks better in person than it does on the video right now. And a whole bunch of, I think these are vinyl records. Although I don't recognize any of them, given, uh, I don't really know the name of Vinyl Records. Oh, this is, no, this is a book. Here. But I think they are mostly Vinyl Records. Very interesting. It all looks to be, uh, looks to be newer. And then a whole bunch of movies which I'm not too interested in, given uh, if I want to see a movie, you can watch it online. I, I don't like having the physical copies. But that's me, and some people like having the physical copies of things, especially when they come special like this. I've been looking at a lot of tools recently, a lot of like stuff for my sim rig that I can do stuff with. Wrenches and screwdrivers are all useful to me right now because uh, I'm doing a lot of like work on on the rig. Or at least I want to. I want to add a little like air conditioning to it. What on earth is this? What on earth is this contraption? I don't even know. It pivots. If you know what that is, let me know in the comments. And then some things that Danny is definitely going to go through. Mugs, plate set. 
It is a fine china made in Indonesia. Those might be something. We'll see what Danny thinks. If she hasn't already visited, that is a funky statue. And then some vases, some more statues, some things that I, I kind of like. These are cute. Just little made in China pieces, but they don't look half bad in person. And then a little camel trinket box. Now I know Danny has not gone through here yet. It has a thing on the bottom, but I can't I can't quite read it because I don't know what to what it is, but it opens up like that. That's a pretty cool find. We'll see what Danny thinks. And one of these little like dividers this would go on the table. I think I think dividers like that are really cool. And then a fairy lamp, or at least I think it is. No, fiberglass, fiberglass. If it's in working condition, these things are very valuable. Although it does have a piece of trash in it, which is quite odd. A ring light, we know all about those for filming. And then a whole bunch of DVDs and movies that I don't feel inclined to go through, because that's a lot. Although there is Interstellar. Interstellar was a good movie. All right, why? I don't know what's going on here. Goodness, still unloading stuff. All right, tools. You can always find tools at the swap meet. That, made in England. Blue Heritage Pattern Wedgewood. Now, I'm not interested in that, but that tells me there could be some good things that came out of whatever locker he got this stuff from. Those are older. I've been finding a lot of these big cat statues lately. Oh, I like you. Camel trinket box, yes please. Although, do you close? Why are you not latching quite, quite right? Oh dear, there's something wrong. He is not, he's not closing. See, that's no good. All right, guess we're gonna pass on him. It's a stork delivering babies and fairies, little fairies. All right, we may come back to that if we find other stuff because I do like to make a pile at this uh, space, but I don't want to just pick up like one or two things because then the price is much higher. Pure Fiji. Oh, it's just a box. It's a nice box. Those are really pretty. Mikasa Avante. Hmm. Shoes. Got some jewelry over here. It's paparazzi though. What was paparazzi doing? Everything is five dollars with the paparazzi. That I know. I bought a lot of it back when it like first was a thing because it was like so fun to just go on there and five dollars, five dollars, like that would be five dollars. Okay, this is really funny. <laughs> He's really naughty though. He is naughty, naughty toilet paper. Retro 1970s style desktop telephone. He did just tell me that next week. He is bringing a lot of good stuff. So I guess I'll have to come back to the swap meet next week. Because now I'm intrigued. Let's see what kind of purses we have tonight. LA. Who makes the LA purse? 
I can do most things left-handed, but I'm really, really bad at unzipping zippers and all that. And there's nothing on the inside. Milan. Mm, Nine West. Nice for Fourth of July. Nice wallet. I'm feeling really, really picky tonight. I'm feeling really picky tonight. We'll see. We'll see how that uh, bodes for me. Oh, those are cute towels. There's Noah over there. <laughs> Even more movies and DVDs that I'm just not all too interested in. There are some lampshades over here, although they don't they don't look to be anything special. They are just absolutely massive. This is my hand next to it. They are very big. And there's Danny over there. There's a whole bunch of shoes right here. I already have my carding shoes. I am not uh, not as big on the hunt for them anymore. I did recently clean them thanks to uh, thanks to Crystal and Angel. They got me some shoe polish that I used, and not only does it does it work for shoes, but it worked for my gloves too. So on my next video, I'm gonna have nice clean gloves and shoes. Some kitcheny stuff. These are quite nice. I. I don't actually think I have one, but if we're going to buy one, we're not going to buy it used. That is a cool toaster. There's some glass on the table over here. Although, none of it feels like cut glass. These are, these are kind of cool, but they're just no brand. Just generic pieces of glass. And then over here are some baking sheets, which I already have too many baking sheets. These fiber optic lamps can do pretty good, but I'm just not feeling like dealing with it tonight. Just not feeling it. I know I'm back to I'm back to him. Still wondering if he can be fixed. I wish he wasn't broken. It's bumming me out. Seriously, bumming me out. See, it's supposed that it's supposed to fit into there, and it it doesn't. It doesn't. Probably something to do with the hinge. All right, I mournfully have to leave him. Well, this is one of my vendors I usually come to. He is not here tonight, but this one is. So we'll come over here and look through see what we can find it's already starting to get dark we thought we got here in time to enjoy a little daylight and nope having to chase all over for the ATM kind of messed us up beaded panels oh, that's interesting that looks like sea glass in there it's kind of cool some of that looks like amberina glass. I wonder if it'll glow. I don't want to dig my black light out right now, but I do want to look at this Fenton little swung vase. We'll find out how much this one is. All right, it is $3, so we're definitely going to pick him up. Is this dust? I don't know. I don't like the looks of that one. I don't really like dealing with decanters. This looks like it's possibly Sadler. Yeah, it is Sadler. See it on the cream and sugar. It's a nice, nice tea set. There it is. Arthur Wood, England. Okay, so this one is not Sadler. Isn't that interesting? So the teapot is not Sadler, but these are Sadler. Okay, let's stick those in the pile right there. 
All right, so I split off immediately because I spotted a Corsair power supply. I gotta see when it's from, because this is a modular power supply. So this could be, it could be something special. Uh, it is, it's a thousand watt power supply. So that's, that's a very expensive power supply, but when was it made? When was it made? This looks like it might be a Nambe. No, it's too lightweight. Too lightweight to be Nambe. Hi. Hi, Noah. How do you scan a barcode? How do you scan a phone? You have to have an app. Like what? You looking at Amazon pricing? Over there. So you want to look up Amazon pricing? I want to see when it was made. Well, you want to see when it's made? I'm trying to find when it's made. Oh. That's how you tell a lot about a power supply. Oh, who knew? Who knew? That is a, uh, that's a good one. Look at these happy little ice cream cones. Those are so fun. So oh that's my goodness, one. this is that that lady who what is Minerva. Minerva, give me a break. Okay, I love her. Actually has a bench to sit on. Okay, now we'll put her in the pile. And this guy's awful cute, but the thermometer part is broken. Oh, it's a spoon teaks. That's too bad. All right, I need to go help Noah go look something up. Now he's got me intrigued. Copper bracelet. It's kind of nice. All right, let's go help Noah. So he wants 60 bucks for it. Says it's only been used a little bit. It's a little over a year old. So that's a pretty good, that's a that's an exceptional price for a power supply if it is in pristine condition, which it still has the warranty sticker on it. It's got the QC pass still. I looked inside at least uh, through the fan and it looked to be all good inside. But for 60 bucks, I don't think it's worth the gamble. It's great if you're using it for you, but it doesn't come with the box and it doesn't come with all of the different wires that it has. It is a modular power supply. So if it doesn't have the wires, you have to buy those wires. And, uh, oh no, it has the wires in there. But, but I'm not all that, uh, I'm not all that interested in buying a new power supply. I would rather have it straight from the company. But it is, it is a killer deal to whoever gets it. Okay, Noah's over there wheeling and dealing on the power. It's a computer power supply. This guy's made by Inesco. I'm not sure how I feel about him. I do like the little uh, pre-Columbian looking, I don't know, incense burner? I don't know what this, because is it hollow through there? It kind of is. But there's definitely right side up that way. You know what? It's cool enough to put in the pile. Let's see what we got here. You are signed. Gray feather. The gray feather items don't sell as high as some of the other Native American. I do believe gray feather is Navajo. It's a cool looking piece though. So we'll put that one in the pile as well. That one is a B. Something I'd have to take that made in USA off of there, but let's try that one too. Passing by some keyboards, got a little. We had one of these. We might still have one of these. A little Atari emulator. Some speaker systems and a headlamp that we might actually end up needing. I hope not. A whole mess of cables, so if you're looking for one thing in particular, you might be able to find it here. Oh, it's got a glass bottom? That is wacky. And, uh... What is this? Uh... I hope that is not a hard disk drive. It might be, though. Another what looks to be a microphone almost. And then some more speaker systems and a what's what's it called? I forget what it's called. 
And I found another one. This one's kind of cool. Look at that with the eagles and the dancers. Oh, this is the same as the other one. Zanali? Zanali. All right, let's grab that one too. All right, I put that over in the pile. Kristen, 2009. Elephant, he's pretty. He's pretty well worn. Oh boy, we got a little grouping of little fittings here. Like a jewelry maker lot. Lace. It's a big heavy bell. Ooh, hello, kitty cats. Oh, I like you. Fan. And then it's just something else on the bottom. Very mid century. It's got a lot of crazing. Oh, gosh darn it. Why does that always have to be the case? Yep, you've had a major head repair. All right, you'll have to stay. Gunther. Those are kind of cool. Ooh, see, a cool ashtray. Noah's standing right in the light. Can you see the big shadow? That would be Noah. <laughs> oh, it's got a flower. Oh, big, heavy, hard to deal with for tonight. <laughs> no, I'm just teasing you. He was moving out of the light. Such a good kid. We got Capiste shell dishes. That's pretty silverware. What makes you, you are Rogers, William Rogers, extra plate. That's a weird handle. A weird handle? That's a weird handle. This stuff used to be really, really, really collectible. I don't know if it still is. I know it's super duper heavy and I don't want to deal with it. Oh, is it not as heavy as I remember? This is very light. Oh, well it is aluminum. No, it's pretty heavy. That's it's still heavy. pretty heavy, yes. Shipping, I'm always thinking in shipping terms. Okay, here's my little pile. I have to get a price on all of it. Stand by. We got it all for 20 bucks. put in the box. All right, it's starting to get dark. Gotta go where the light is. Cool lion. I know, he's cool. Little little ocean scene there. Yeah, I'm less about that. You're less You're about that? Yeah, I have a really nice painted one. Let's see what we can find in here. Lots of clothes. So starting over here by some of the kitcheny stuff, got a Keurig, a blender, nothing all too special. Some like cookie jars, and a muffin baking sheet, and a little a little goat metal holder. He's shivering. What did you find? He's is it goat? He's an ear. Oh, he is missing an ear. There's race cars over here, Noah. Race car alert. There's, also There's cars. Car There's also fake plants right here. Eh, this one's got a got a weird face, but this one on the other hand. I wish it was a little bit more realistic. The really realistic ones are awesome. Some movie stuff. Some NASCARs. I'm not all too interested in NASCAR. Uh, great question. I don't know. She's a dragster driver. I'm not all too into uh, NASCAR. At least uh, 
virtually. I don't want to... I, I could drive a NASCAR in, in a game, but I would not uh, watch NASCAR online. I would, however, watch NASCAR in person. In person watching NASCAR is a completely different thing to seeing it on the screen. Oh, I have to show those to Noah. Real little trees, Sarah. Nice mortar and pestle. I do see the glass chickens. Oh, that's a penguin. One chicken and a penguin and another penguin and a turtle. Believe it or not, I, I could, I could actually, I'm selling one like this in my whatnot sale tomorrow, which will already happen by the time you see this video. But I do my whatnot sales every Monday, Wednesday, and Saturday at 3 p.m. Pacific time. So many, many, many of the items that you see me buy end up in my whatnot sales. Oh, look at that cool articulated fish. He's fun. All right, well, I went to follow Danny and these are absolutely amazing. Oh, but they do, they do look very fake there. But this one right here, oh, hit my head on a, hit my head on something. This is amazing. Oh, it's got a, it's got a little bird in the tree. This. Oh, it's, it's something I would put in my room, but I don't know. I don't know that I really have space for something like that. Is that a cowbell? That's a, that's a major cowbell right there. That's pretty awesome, actually. Oh, the lights are on, and uh, we got to keep boogieing. Let's go over here, see what's happening in this booth. I always managed to find a few cool things. Wow, they've got a lot of M&Ms. Let's pull the, our wagon a little bit closer, Noah. He left it a little bit far out there. Look at the get a grip uh, green M&M window. Where are you? When are you from? Do you have a date? You should have a date because you got candy in you. I don't see a date. I don't know. She's kind of cool. All right, let's get in here and. Oh no! Are you kidding me right now? Oh, it's got a broken leg. That's that's a tragedy right there. Lots of M and M's. Let's see what else we got besides M and M's in here. Little wallet. Oh, Noah's over there uh, looking at a purse. I love when he does Noah cam. I love just to hear his perspective on things as a younger generation looking at this stuff. I hope you guys like it too. If you do, I would love to know down in the comments what you think about Noah Cam. And he likes to read the comments too. All right, we're getting into some loud music on this side. I am not sure we may be just showing you stuff and not actually doing voice, but if you hear my voice, well then that didn't happen now, did it? Oh, they say joy. They're just taped together. Yeah, I've got some Coke Zero. Lots of M&M's. I know, there's lots of M&M's. Somebody's whole M&M collection. It's because there's a NASCAR team with Oh, the Hulk's pretty cool too, but he's, oh, he's, he's, very, broken. he's very, very broken, yeah. Finding some interesting stuff over here. The music is a little bit loud, so I'm going to try and talk loud to make sure we don't pick any of it up. There's some jewelry here. A, a pretty nice purse. That is a very, very interesting purse. It feels like leather. It feels like... Uh, like, it's probably leather. I'd be surprised if it wasn't. But that is very cool. 
And over here we have a little uh, water gun, little pin, and a whole bunch of remotes and electronics that I'm not entirely interested in. And a big old flashlight. We could use one of these, although this one just has a single diode. Which, diodes are just the little light pieces, so... It probably is not very bright. It's just big. We got on this table. We get a little reprieve from the loud music for a moment. I don't know what his purpose is. I'm really bummed my jewelry guy is in here. He told me last time I was here that he was going to California for a while. He'll be back in the fall. That's a pretty Cruet set. So I call this guy usually has really good stuff, but but <laughs> that's beautiful. Twenty dollars. Look at that. It's plastic though. It is not stone. Tiki legs. Since the world Ultima. It's got a bell. So how much would this little here's trinket? A, here's a third one. It's made in Turkey. How much would that be? It's not marked there? It says twenty. So I'll do uh, fourteen. You do fourteen on that? Right now. Here's another one. Yeah. yeah. Tom Clark gnome. I used to have lots of these. Not personally. I used to resell them. They resold very well. Alright. Not quite at my resale prices. Alright. I'm here to get Bougie all stocked back up. Ah, uh, Bougie. I'm bringing you home your pistachios. Do you want a pistachio? I am going to pick this up for $3. Let's see what else you have. He's interesting. It got so dark so fast. Ooh, I like that one too. I think I'll pick that up. It's getting set up. Oh, can you give me some light, Noah? That's what I'm doing. Noah's gonna get me some light. Oh, look at that. Oh, he's cool. Look at that big glass lion. Okay, we'll put him in the pile. Oh, maybe, maybe it glows. I'll, I'll dig out my black light. Oh, those are cute. Little chicken, little chicken salt and peppers. We'll get those too. Okay. Noah, put the light away for a second. Look at that. It's a glower. Look at it. I can clear her table as fast as she's setting it up. <laughs> Some pretty Fenton hobnail cranberry opalescent. Let's put that over there. Not that one. Oh, cute. Oh, and you got the little apple dishes that go with it. I love that. So this guy is. 
He's nice quality. It reminds me of a Yadro, but he's not marked. Oh wait, there he is. Made in Spain. Ooh, maybe he is. Let's put him in the pile too. That is a pretty little ruby red dish. Fun little cat. He's a bank. I just felt a slot on the bank. Pate? Patty? Patty. Patty. It's kind of fun. Got some amber glass, some green glass. I love this pattern. I think it's called Sorrento. It's a fun, it's a fun pattern. Okay. I was looking back through here and I found this lion, but Noah, can you feel his tail? Oh, it looks like it is. Yep. It's got a broken tail. A little broken tail. All right, I think we have our little pile over here. I, may, I might have to stay here a while. She keeps un unloading some more stuff here. Look, you know I like these. And then I found this little guy. He's even got his little planter. So we're gonna add those. Pretty little jade tree. Oh, is that a little kitty cat soap dish? He is a little kitty cat soap dish. What's that? Oh yeah, that'll clean up. I think that, yeah, that's a schmoosh. Just schmoosh, it'll clean up. All right, she sold me all of that for $25 total. I am super happy. Uh, and I didn't get her name, but she is a subscriber of the channel. So thank you so much for the awesome deal. Really appreciate it. The, the blue, the blue vase drew me in and then see what happens. All right, now I think, ooh, ooh, little fireworky things. Run them over. <laughs> I think we are gonna call it a night. So stay tuned for the recap. Yeah. Where you'll see what we bought, how much it's worth, how much we paid, how much we paid, and how much it's worth. <laughs> and you'll see the name of it too. Yeah. Yeah, I'll tell you what we bought, what we paid, and how much it's worth in the recap. That's coming up. I wasn't at. I was in the in the mojo. That's coming up. It. Right now. Right now.
fun little night at the swap meet. I didn't get crazy. One box full, really, is all I ended up with. Yay! Somebody was hungry. Fries. Now, I'm not a big fan of McDonald's, but it's right here. And it was convenient. And it was easy. And they have good breakfast. They have good coffee. Yeah. I like McDonald's coffee. All right, we're heading home. <laughs> we're heading home. I'm waiting for him to say it. Go be profitable. And? Make it fun. <laughs> we'll see you on the next one.